There we go. Now, on this clip, I want to do something really special to make the ending epic. I'd like to try mixed reality, but I don't really know how to get started. So, for inspiration, I'm going to go and open the Remix 3D community. This is a community site that is packed with the cool things people are making and remixing in 3D. And you can see I opened it up right here in Story Remix, just like I would in Paint 3D. That means that I can get cool ideas and content without even having to leave the app. And of course, I'm showing this to you in our first party experience. But I am thrilled to tell you that we'll be releasing all of these APIs so that all Windows developers can have access to our 3D cloud in their apps. We want this content, these creations, to be easy to share across apps and the web, just like any other type of content. So we're part of the Kronos community. We support GLTF, like many industry leaders in 3D, as an open standard file format for 3D objects in apps. And we also support the Babylon JS Web 3D engine, so that these creations show up beautifully across the web. So I came here to look for inspiration for that final clip, and there's this fireball here that's intriguing to me. Let's open it up and take a look. Okay, so this fireball is in a scene, and scenes are made up of parts. And I can see all the parts that make up that scene, as well as their creators, and I could use any part as a starting point for my creation. And thanks to a new feature of Remix 3D, the original creators will get credit any time I build something new. So there's that fireball that caught my eye. Let's open it up. And then if I want more ideas, I can see all the ways other people have been remixing the fireball right below it. And I do have an idea of what I want to do with this fireball. So let me move the video to right where she kicks her soccer ball. OK. Now let's put the fireball in the project, move it over to the, fireball, or the soccer ball, and then I'm going to anchor it to the object. Let's see how this looks. That's good, but it's not enough. I want to go even bigger, and I want to end this video with a bang. So I'm going to go back. Wait, let's end this video right here with a bang. I'll put it right there. I'm going to go back to our Remix community, open it up, and this time I'm going to search for explosion. Aha, here's an explosion that'll do. Let's place it in my project, move it into the goal. And this time I'm going to anchor it to the surface, so that means it'll stay in place even when the camera moves during the video. Okay, who wants to see the epic ending to my highlight video? Let's watch it. <laughs> 